Hello, Beret Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. And this weekend, it is Sunday. It is fun day. I mean, the sun is finally kind of like getting back here in LA. I don't know if you hear about this, but like we have been having some like gloomy days, and people were like losing their minds. I get it. You know, look, I'm from Bogota, so like I'm used to like the gloomy days, but people over right here girl they go crazy okay like they don't i mean if they if it rains people don't they, they don't even know how to like drive here like people were going like all like depressed and sad you know and i'm like girl i mean it's just a cloud but like now it's back to normal and i get it i get it you know when the sun is out it's a little bit better even though i i do not like the sun you know i'm like a little vampire like if you have been following me you know you know so um but anyways, how are you guys? I want to welcome every single one of you. If you are new here, welcome to the Verbally Troop, where we spill the tea every single day, no matter where I am, no matter what I'm doing, okay? Uh, so if you are new here, welcome to the Verbally Troop. I do my uh, show every single day from Monday to Friday. It's called The Real Andy of Very Hill Show that you do not want to miss because all the tea is in there. And during the weekends, you know, I do the, these little pieces of tea, you know, here and there. So if you're new, you know what to do. Subscribe, 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 and hit that notification bell because you do not want to miss all, all the tea that is going on right now. Okay, guys, so let's talk about this mess. It is time to talk about Miss Selena Gomez, okay? Because, girl, she is living in the best moment right now of her life. Not only she is very happy with her with her boyfriend, Benny Blanco, and they are, like, living, you know, uh, they, they, are, they still are on the honeymoon phase. They are just, like, on cloud nine. But now she is getting all of this praise for you know this new movie that she's going to be on right and it just got a nine minute standing ovation at the Cannes film festival you know and it is like literally like record-breaking situation like everyone got so happy about her performance on this new movie that she's going to be in that Everyone went crazy for it. And she, you can see, like, there is a video running around. I'm going to try to put it over here. But if not, you know, I'm going to put it on my social media. And uh, this video of, like, she receiving this, like, like standing ovation from all of her peers, everyone in there. And she's literally fighting her tears. And you can, you can feel the emotion. Like, you can literally, um... It is so cute, honestly. Like, I was, like, literally, like, crying watching that video, right? And um, eventually she ended up, like, you know, having some tears and stuff. Uh, very so cute. She did such, I mean, they said, you know, I haven't watched the movie, but they said that she did such an incredible, incredible job. So I want to read you a little bit of the article, you know, so you get, like, what people are saying. Um, this is coming from TMC and they're saying Selena Gomez is taking yet another step back towards her acting roots because a movie uh, she's in just premiered at Cannes and people loved it. Getting on their feet for her, making for some light waterworks. The singer was spotted wiping away tears after her forthcoming music musical crime drama Emilia Paris received an impressive nine minute standing ovation at the Cannes Film Festival yesterday. Okay. Sally tried to keep her composure as all eyes were on her at the end of the screening, but her emotions eventually got the better of her. You can tell it meant a lot that people liked the performance. And frankly, it's a good sign that she is all in or on her acting career yet again. Selena was joined at the screening by co-stars Zoe Saldana and Edgar Ramirez, who celebrated their film warm reception with a couple of hugs. Selena has been living it up in the south of France this whole weekend, by the way, all of which she documented on social media 
including all of the after party picks. Of course, Selena dressed to impress at Cannes, rocking a black and white gown, rounding out the look with an impressive diamond necklace and earrings. For later in the evening, she swapped out her gown for a green mini dress which show off her tan legs. Her boyfriend, Benny Blanco, could not get enough from home as he commented on her Instagram, speechless. Here comes the second wave of Selena on the screen, y'all. Well, I have to tell you, I think this is such an amazing thing for her. She is a very talented actress, you know, and she has done so much. I mean, we have seen her for years and years and years. And I think this is going to be such um, an amazing experience for her. You know, I think her music is in general, like also very good. But if you ask me, I have always been more of a fan of, you know, her movies and her shows, you know, and following her like around and all of that. I mean, I love her music as well, but like, you know what I mean, right? And I think maybe um, getting this uh, like nine minute, what, what do you do for nine minutes? Like everyone is like clapping at you and celebrating you. You know, imagine nine minutes for nine minutes. That's like, that's just, like wow you know i think that is going to give her or ignite some kind of like flame inside of her you know for the acting passion because i think she will be great doing more movies there is very few people who can actually be in singers and actors at the same time and actually like do a good job you know what i mean so i think and she's one of those so I think it will be perfect for her to maybe, you know, uh, go full force on this acting, maybe try to pursue like an Emmy or, of course, an Oscar, you know, or a Golden Globe or like maybe trying to get that EGOT, you know what I mean? Um, because she could do it. I think 100% she could definitely um, get it if she really put her mind on it. Well, she will have to fight for the Tony because that's a very hard one to get. But anyways, someone who is talented could definitely do it, right? So anyways, uh, let me know what you guys think on the comments below about all of this. And yeah, uh, I just want to give, uh, before we go, a quick shout out to the partners of this video. So don't forget, all of my collaborations are very much active with Rose Forever and Liquid IV, okay? So go to the link in the description below. All of the discount codes are in there. And um, you can take advantage of all of that because I love, love, the, love my, um, my, 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 my partners, okay? <laughs> so anyways, I love you guys. Don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.